Hey guys, welcome. Cindy Williams here, CEO of Careers on Vacation. I have a special guest all the way from Australia, Crystal from Ticket Travel and Events. Crystal, how are you today? Hello, I am very well, thank you. How are you? I'm good. It's funny, we were just discussing it's summer here and winter there and day <laughs> yeah. here and day there. I love this how the internet just connects everybody around the world though. Isn't it amazing? Uh, it's magical. It really is. It's fun. Well, you were a recent graduate of our Careers on Vacation program, and we wanted to just invite you on to share a little bit about your amazing story and your journey. So if you wouldn't mind, tell the audience where your business was before taking Careers on Vacation and kind of where you are now. Yeah, well, before finding the program, I had already set up my business um, the best that I knew how because I had the travel experience but I'd never run a business before um, and that was always in the back of my mind whether I uh, set it up correctly what have I missed and it was just something that really bothered me so I was trying to find a coach or mentor that was experienced in the travel agency and I couldn't believe it or not find anyone in Australia that was travel specific um, and so I took out the word Australia and started Googling and came across you and saw all of your YouTube videos and um, I was like, this is exactly what I need. It's going to put my mind at ease that my business is set up correctly and I'm going to get so much extra juicy information that I don't already know about. Um, and so then I, I spoke to the beautiful Christine and she answered all of my questions and as soon as I got off the call, I was like, this is something I think I really need to do. And finding the program was the best thing. Um, I just, yeah, I now have everything set up from A to Z and I know exactly what I need to do. And I've got a whole process in place, which I didn't have before. Yeah, those processes and systems, it makes such a difference in your day-to-day -day and workflow and being able to kind of automate more time, all that good stuff stuff what would you say has been your biggest win since taking the program uh, definitely having a marketing plan uh, before that I was outsourcing it and I had no clue how to generate leads and how to bring in new business um, and outsourcing just spent the money but didn't really bring anything in and after taking the program actually understanding where to post what to post how to do it all, the automated systems are a lifesaver. Um, and so then you just have everything laid out step by step and it makes it so much easier. So the marketing was the biggest savior for me. Yeah, for sure. And a lot of people do outsource. It looks really attractive, right? Like, oh, we'll throw a bunch of social media posts and we'll do these things for you. But what, what gets missed there is if you have a custom business you're trying to grow is are you, is it really generating leads? In your case, I know we looked at it and it was not. So it's, how do I reach those leads? How do I kind of get out into that audience and, and start that process where people understand what you do and you're attracting the right type of people because that is what changes the playing field. So that's amazing. Yes. Now in our program, you know, we do a lot of mindset work, getting you to think like a CEO, making sure that making that transition if there are any self-doubts, whether it's about your business or life, we know if we can get you to operate from a great place up here, it'll give you a great business and ultimately, in some cases, change your entire life. What did the mindset work do for you while either for your business or for your life or anything that you'd like to share? Um, that was something that I didn't even really think about, to be completely honest, before the program was in place. I didn't think about getting myself in the right headspace. I just assumed I was already there. Um, and then actually sitting down, writing the affirmations, and then rereading them to yourself later on. And when something gets difficult or you start to question things, you just go back and continue reading that. And it really does make this important shift that just gives you the confidence to just keep going and makes you realize again why you're on this journey. And for me, it just helped with the procrastination of everything, not just the business, but just thinking, oh, I'll get to that later, I'll get to that later. And then piling things up was what I was used to doing. And now with the affirmations, I'm like, no, 
I'm here today. Now is the right time. Let's just get this done. So yeah. execute really that extra accountability and all that good stuff. And yeah. it's just easy to pile up. Like when you're like, oh, I want to learn something about X, Y, Z. And you go and you start, I always say it's like a rabbit hole or like pulling a thread on your sweater. Like you start yeah. and you're like, oh wait, that let that, that kind of sit over here. But um, that's amazing. I'm so glad. And that's, that's why we put it in the program. So that's, that's great. So at, now that you've been through the whole program, you're a graduate, your agency is up and running. Would you recommend careers on vacation to other people who were in a similar spot before you started? Absolutely. No hesitation. I would recommend them. Yourself and your team is outstanding. And especially, I know you help agents of all different levels, but especially for the new agents or people who have never run a business, it just takes away that fear. It just gives you the confidence and um, you've always got that extra support whenever you're doubting yourself or you've got that amazing group of people that are going through on the same journey and sometimes they're asking the same question. So you don't even need to ask it. You just need to look at the group or you could easily send a message. I'm all the way in Australia and I never had a problem with yourself or Stephanie or anyone getting back to me. And it was just always so instantaneous. It didn't even feel like we were in two parts of the world. I know, all the way across the globe, which I love so, so much. And um, that, that's the beauty, not just of the mastermind, but how the support structure, because some people are like, oh, do I get a training module? Do I get a phone call? Like you get everything. You get modules, you get calls every single week, you get private coach assigned to you, you get the Facebook group that you can go in and ask your questions. So whether you're in Australia or the UK or Canada or the US, we are, we're there supporting you guys through your journey. It's very hands-on. Um, one last question for you. When you, when you were looking at, or when you found us, was it tough for you to lean in when you were to like get over the fence or were there any hurdles you had to get over before you got started? Yeah. So I just continued watching your videos and every time it ended, I was like, I know this is the right thing for me, but, um, the finance side of things was something that I needed to work out. And this is where the mindset comes in because you really do need to take that chance on yourself and you really need to go in 100% and give it everything you've got to be able to reap any kind of rewards at the end of it. And just making that conscious decision to, you know, I, I do have to spend the money and I do have to get in the right headspace and I have to do what they're telling me to do because at the end of the day, you've been through this and you know what the right is and what the wrong is. And for anyone out there that's doubting it, the program works. It absolutely 110% works and you will be so happy that you invested in yourself. I love it. I love that. And it's kind of like, am I worth it? Is my business worth it? You know, it's and going through that process because especially like, I feel like women in general and moms and there's dads out there too, but sometimes we feel guilty about spending money on ourselves. And it's not a yeah. pair of shoes, it's not a new bracelet or a watch, it's an investment in your business. So um, I love that you leaned in, it's, been su it's just been our honor to help you from all the way across the world in Australia and to watch your business grow over there. I know you're going to be coming up on one of our Bliss to Abundance shows because we're doing an interview. So if you guys want to learn more about Crystal's business, I'm going to invite you to go over to Roku or Amazon Fire because her show is going to be coming out. Sometime in the next four weeks, we have a lot queued up in editing right now, but we're going to be doing an expansion on uh, learning about exactly what she's doing over there in Australia because you do some cool stuff. Um, but I just want to thank you for sharing your story today, Crystal, and you know, you're going into the grad group now. And guys, listen, if you're thinking about launching, growing, or building your travel business, just like Crystal wanted to do, reach out to us at careersonvacation.com. That is what we help you do. So you can go to careersonvacation.com forward slash ready now to apply for the program. And again, Crystal, thank you so much for joining us this evening in Texas and this morning in Australia. Thank you so much. It's been an absolute pleasure. It really has. Thanks, Crystal. We'll see you over the grad group, okay? Okay, bye. Bye. Hang on one second.